from its lush tropical forests and towering mountains to the endless stretches of golden beaches caressed by azure waters. The Dominican Republic is a true feast for the senses. Amidst this natural beauty, we've assembled the top 10 adults-only all-inclusive resorts that stand as perfect retreats for those seeking peace, beauty, and a touch of fun and adventure. But before we get started, we wanted to take a moment to say that, as we all know, everyone has their own personal tastes, likes, and dislikes. So what may be your top choice for accommodations could easily be someone else's worst. Knowing this, we decided to create this and all of our lists based on thousands of guest reviews from the three most popular hotel booking sites, Booking.com, Kayak.com, TripAdvisor.com, and also YouTube guest reviews. And because so many of you always ask, we've also chosen to include room rates. Although we must remind you that actual rates can vary greatly depending on the time of year and length of your stay, which site and when you book, and what, if any, discounts that may be offered when you book. Now, with all that out of the way, let's get started. Kicking things off at number 10 is Iberostar Grand Pavaro with an average price of $423 per night. If you're looking for a quieter resort away from the bustling party scenes of some of the other resorts, then Iberostar Grand Bavaro is a nice option. It only has 274 rooms, which means there isn't as big of a crowd and it doesn't get as rowdy. It's got an Instagram-worthy Greco-Roman design with a lobby that wraps around a courtyard outside and the front of the property has a decorative lake with an iconic three-mast ship that you're going to want to take a photo of. It's also right on Bavaro Beach, which is largely regarded as one of the most beautiful places in the Dominican Republic. There are three different pools and two whirlpools to soak in, and the main pool has a swim-up bar. You'll find a nice variety of beers, cocktails, and frozen drinks at the swim-up bar, and you can enjoy service all around the pool. There are four other bars at the resort, a cigar bar, a lobby bar, and even a lively bar on the ship that's open late as well as four restaurants. The fitness center includes views of the ocean as well as spinning and tai chi classes, and the two-level spa in the same building provides hammams and couples massages. The beach features lounge chairs, and you can reserve day beds and palapas for extra relaxation next to the waves. It's such a gorgeous laid-back resort that most guests opt to just enjoy the resort for the majority of their time in the DR. At number 9 is TRS Turquesa Hotel, average price $308 a night. The TRS Turquesa Hotel is 372 rooms and it's the adults-only area of the Palladium Complex, but with a calmer vibe than the neighboring hotels. Its decor is a nice combination of chic and natural elements and because it's part of a four-hotel complex, the property grounds are expansive. And it has a long beach with a private area for guests where you won't find vendors or kids, but you will find palapas and chairs. The complex is so large that there's a train trolley to transport guests. Some rooms include swim-up rooms or outdoor jetted tubs, and the cabana suites are in gorgeous bungalow-type buildings, while the Royal Presidential Suite has two floors with an ocean view. There are two restaurants on site as well as five different bars and some snack areas by the lobby and pool. In total, the complex has eight different restaurants, five buffets and 17 bars, and you get a butler who you can contact to make reservations for dining at other resorts. There are also a number of pools around the complex, including four big pools and swim-up bars. Turquesa has a fitness center and a sports center that has a soccer field, tennis courts, mini golf course, basketball court, and archery. Between the various resorts in the complex, you're sure to find excellent food and drinks and have a great time. Coming in at number 8 is Chic by Royalton Luxury Resorts, with an average price of $667 per night. Chic is a resort with a fun vibe that has rapidly become one of the most desirable resorts for adults in Punta Cana. The resort's 323 rooms feature beds with cool purple LED backlights and open concept bathrooms. Suites have whirlpool tubs and more purple LED lights, as well as separate sitting areas, and some even have private plunge pools. For large parties, there's the Chic Mansion, which has 11,400 square feet and has six bedrooms, as well as a private pool, butler service, beach cabanas with a personal attendant, 
free spa treatments for 30 minutes, and a culinary experience right in the dining room of the mansion. The resort has three stunning pools with blue mosaic tiles that are dazzling in the sunlight. The largest has shallow ledges that allows guests to submerge their lounge chairs in the water a bit. The main pool has a swim-up bar and private water cabanas, lounge chairs, and hot tubs that can be rented. While the smallest of the three features a volleyball net where tournaments are held. The gigantic beach is well-kept, and there are lots of Palapa-style umbrellas and cushy daybeds around. And if you upgrade to the Diamond Club, then you can access the private lounge area and bar on the beach. The fitness center and spa are housed in the same building on the property and feature life fitness and matrix equipment. The spa is quite roomy and has separate areas for solo treatments, couples and brides, as well as a salon and hydrotherapy. Free Wi-Fi is strong throughout the resort, which is nice because some places have spotty signals. Then there are six different restaurants to choose from, including an open-air beachfront buffet restaurant, and there's even a coffee bar and cafe where you can find a rarity in Punta Cana, iced coffee. At number seven is Secrets Royal Beach Punta Cana with an average price of $555 per night. If you're looking for an all-inclusive with lots of activities and entertainment, then Secrets Royal Beach is the way to go. It has 464 rooms with three pools and a gorgeous beach. One of the pools winds through the resort like a lazy river and even has wooden bridges over it. And Secrets partners with the now Laramar Punta Cana, which is literally next door, which means you have access to things like a spa and casino. However, now Laramar is a family-friendly resort, which means that if you don't want to be around kids, then you'll have to avoid that resort but you'll also be missing out on extra dining options and amenities. The beach at Secrets is the only part of the resort that tends to get a little loud the later into the day it gets. The beach itself is an impressive size and has lounge chairs and umbrellas, as well as ping pong tables and beach volleyball. The rooms have private terraces or balconies, some of which have hot tubs or swim up access and all of the usual resort room amenities. There are five restaurant options at Secrets Royal, and food and drinks from now Laramar are included as well. There are numerous bars scattered throughout the resort, like a swim-up bar, beach club, and a lobby lounge, and more pools at the now Laramar also. But the nightly entertainment and daily activities are definitely a standout feature of Secrets Royal Beach. At number six is Luxury Bahia Principe K11 Tado, Average price, $489 per night. If you're looking for a secluded experience with beautiful rooms and a great view, then you can't go wrong with the luxury Bahia Principe K11 Tado. This is the only resort in the Dominican Republic to be located on a private island just off the Samana Peninsula. There's a nice relaxing vibe here that'll have you feeling tranquil in no time. Rooms are some of the best in the Dominican Republic and feature king-sized beds, a sitting area with wicker furniture, and a marble bathroom that looks a bit like a Greek bath. There are two pools, one close to the resort and the other near the beach, with bars and lounge chairs near both, and there's a snack bar by the beachside pool that has a well-stocked buffet full of hamburgers, hot dogs, chicken fajitas, pizza, vegetarian options, and other entrees. There are seven restaurants on site in total. However, the bars and lounges close at midnight, and there aren't any other options for buying alcohol at the resort. You do have a bit in your mini fridge, but it may not be enough for some partiers. Coming in at the middle of the pack at number five is Hilton La Romana, average price $530 per night. Formerly the Dreams La Romana, the Hilton La Romana is 356 rooms of upscale beachy style. It shares amenities with its next-door sister property, the Hilton La Romana All-Inclusive Family Resort. Suites feature all of the usual amenities, with either furnished balconies or terraces and rainfall showers, and there's also swim-out suites that open into a shared pool. The beach has two bars and plenty of umbrellas and lounge chairs, with a private area for premium guests, as well as a wooden dock that goes out over the water, providing access to the coral reef found along the property. 
you can find the water sports and tour excursion vendor in the same facility, which makes it easy to set up boat tours of the island, scuba diving, or snorkeling. There are four different restaurants at the adult resort, which features a buffet, a beachside seafood restaurant, Mediterranean food, Asian food, and more. Room service and a la carte options are included, but you'll have to pay a delivery fee unless you're a premium member. There's also a coffee shop that sells both hot and cold drinks 24-7, a lobby bar, beach bars, and swim-up bars. The Hilton La Romano also has two pretty large pools that both have swim-up bars, one of which is an infinity pool with ocean views, where you can rent day beds or access loungers and use umbrellas for free. Many activities take place in this main pool. The other is for premium guests and has all of the amenities of the main pool, but is more private. The resort spa has a variety of treatments and massages to choose from, and there's a fitness center with ample equipment. The casino and disco in the resort are also available to guests of the family-friendly resort, and they're open late. With the disco, casino, and nightly entertainment, there's definitely a lively night scene at the Hilton La Romana. At number four is Breathless Punta Cata Resort and Spa, average price $399 a night. The massive property at the Breathless Punta Cana Resort and Spa will provide ample opportunities to get away. And although there are 740 rooms, it doesn't feel crowded. It actually is one of the most luxurious resorts in Punta Cana, and if you choose the unlimited luxury option, you get food, alcohol, water sports, and themed pool parties, private pools and lounges, upgraded mini bars, and a more expansive room service menu with the Exhale Club. Rooms have open floor plans with all of the usual amenities, and every room comes with a balcony or terrace complete with a whirlpool. You'll find lots of swimming pools at the resort, and they have extra features like a lazy river, whirlpool and swim-up bars, as well as sunbeds, loungers, and umbrellas. This stunning white sand beach has loads of lounge chairs that face the ocean, and there's food and drink service on the beach as well. The spa by Pavonia includes a salon, massage rooms, and a juice bar with healthy snacks. The fitness center has more than a dozen cardio machines, strength training equipment, balance balls, and free weights. Non-motorized water sports, tennis courts, workouts, Spanish classes, and daily dances are included with the unlimited luxury package, and you can pay extra for horseback riding, scuba diving, excursions, and day trips. There's a theater on site, as well as nightly entertainment like a small casino, themed pool parties, and live music. Eight different restaurants plus a beachside grill and international buffet are included as well as several bars, and there's no limit on premium drinks. But because of the size of the property, you won't feel boxed in, claustrophobic, or crowded. And if someone gets a little loud on one side, you likely wouldn't notice on the other side making it a great choice for people who aren't looking for wild party vibes. Taking the bronze medal at number three is Sanctuary Cap Canna, with an average price of $743 per night. On a gorgeous cliffside location, this stately Spanish-looking castle of a resort, with its 323 rooms, has a captivating beach of white sand that slopes down into the ocean. You can find cabanas and lounge chairs there, as well as a quirky beach bar in the shape of a boat that serves up wraps, burgers, and drinks. And if you love interesting architecture, history, or the Middle Ages, then you'll likely be enchanted by this sanctuary Capcana. There are three different types of rooms, colonial, castle, and villas. Every room has a furnished outdoor area and many have views of the ocean, and you have the option to get upgrades like hot tubs, outdoor pools, and sunbeds that face the ocean. There are an incredible six swimming pools, with the main one being a huge infinity pool that overlooks the beach and has a swim-up bar and a hot tub also. You can also enjoy poolside drink service, and there are sometimes fun activities and games that take place at the pools. The Sanctuary Spa is a generous 20,000 square feet, and the fitness center is well-equipped, with both free weights and cardio machines, plus classes like water aerobics and yoga, as well as beach volleyball, ping pong, darts, and horseshoes. Sanctuary has multiple restaurants, 
at least five, and features a variety of cuisines like a steakhouse, buffet, Asian, and Italian. The sanctuary town is a unique aspect of the resort. It's a plaza that features bars and cafes that serve up all-inclusive food and also serves as the location of the nightly entertainment. One of the biggest draws of the sanctuary for many people is its close proximity to the Punta Espada Golf Club, which is an 18-hole par 72 golf course designed by Jack Nicklaus. So whether you're in need of some pampering, entertainment, or want to get in a few holes, Sanctuary is a great choice. At number two is the Hyatt Zalara Cap Canna, average price $807 a night. Hyatt Zalara Cap Canna is an adults-only resort in the gated community of Cap Canna, and it's right on Winello Beach, which is one of the most coveted beaches in the Dominican Republic. Ocean View Master Suites come with a living space, dining table, and sofa, 55-inch TV in the living area, and another in the bedroom, a soaking tub and shower in the bathroom, a second bathroom with a shower, a balcony with an outdoor jacuzzi, and seating area. For all-inclusive meals, it's actually worth it to spring for the club level at Hyatt Zalara Capcana, because club guests get breakfast, lunch, and dinner at the two beachfront restaurants, while other guests only get dinner. And there are actually two resorts that you get access to when you check into Zalara, with the other being Ziva, and it's where children are allowed to roam. There are 12 restaurants and 8 bars to choose from. Between the two, you've got Italian, Indian, French, Mongolian, seafood, Caribbean, and other options to choose from. There's a massive infinity pool with hot tubs on either side of it to take a dip in, and the pool itself is the location of several activities throughout the day, like water aerobics. The beach itself is gorgeous, where you can lounge in chairs beside it or take part in non-motorized water sports that are included with your stay. There's a huge gym with loads of classes like spin, Pilates, and Zumba, as well as classes on the beach. The Laramar Spa features the first Himalayan salt lounge in the Dominican Republic, which is a hydrotherapy pool resembling a cave. There's nightly entertainment at the resort like live bands, Cirque du Soleil-style acts, and even people dressed in costumes over on the Ziva side. But one of the best things about Hyatt Zalera Capcana is the Canapolis Water Park. There's everything from a relaxing lazy river and a splash pad for young children to adrenaline-pumping huge slides and everything in between. And coming in at number one is Excellence Punta Cana, with an average price of $367 per night. Excellence Punta Cana is indeed, no pun intended, an excellent resort that underwent a $45 million renovation back in 2017, which unfortunately also took out the casino. But don't worry, because there's still plenty of other amenities and features here. Excellence has 450 suites, 10 restaurants, 12 bars, a nightclub, a swim-up bar, and an open-air sports bar. As it's an adults-only resort, and not a couples-only resort, there are some party-goers, which can inject some fun into the atmosphere. Rooms come with all the usual amenities that you expect from a nice resort, along with furnished balconies or terraces, with some rooms having swim-up access. The private beach has loungers and umbrellas with bars nearby, and you can walk a little further to Bavaro Beach to swim in the calm waves. There are two pools, and the main pool stretching nearly the length of the entire property and facing the ocean, and the second pool is by the garden and features a waterfall infinity edge. There's a gym with techno gym cardio equipment, an attached yoga studio, and Pilates and yoga classes daily. Millie Spa has two whole floors, numerous treatment rooms, a salon, and a special bridal suite. On top of all of that, free activities like a 30-minute horseback ride, bike tours, tennis lessons, intro to scuba, and Spanish lessons are all offered as well as nightly entertainment. Well folks, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching, and as always, safe travels!